Welcome back, everyone. It's day five in Madagascar. We're here in Camp Kata. Got the mountains behind me up there. Camp Kata is famous for its ring-tailed lemurs. The scientific name for ring-tailed lemur being Lima Kata. We're going to go for breakfast now, and then we have a five-hour walk around the reserve here. This mountain's called the Chameleon. That's because the top looks like a chameleon. And that's where we're walking today. So I'll camp all the way over there. This is an acacia tree. This is an entrance to an ant's nest, and it's so big because inside is a Madagascan cat-eyed snake. They have a symbiotic relationship. The cat-eyed snake gets a home as a pretty consistent temperature. You will also eat blind snakes, which are one of the ant's main predators, so the ants are kept safe. Camp is the one right down there in the trees. That's how far we've come, and that's where we've got to go. Just gotta go up there and then we make it to the top. We made it to the top. <laughs> Back down there to our camp, all the way over there. So we were just up there, and now we're coming down. There's another termite mound. We stopped off at a little waterfall and we'll brought us some drinks because we were running low on water. And now we're just relaxing from what we did last hour. So the villagers use this plant to make rope like this. These insects live on trees and they drink the water out of the branches 
and it kills the plant, and that's why it's covered in this white. We just got back from the chameleon. That six hour walk turned to a nine hour walk. It was a lot harder than I expected. Our guide was amazing, gave us a lot of help over the rough terrain. We stopped at that little natural pool where someone brought some more drinks because us, including our guides, all ran out of water. Uh, yeah, I think nine hours, the one advantage of the fact that my legs are killing me is that last bit, the temperature outside dropped enough because it got to what, around three ish. The lemurs start to come out of the trees again, they go hide in the trees with the shade when it's hot. As the temperature starts to drop a tiny bit, there's an account we saw them all jumping across the path, which is really nice. The chameleon isn't the only trail here, there are a few others, some slightly easier and shorter, some slightly longer and harder. But you have got options, so yeah, you don't have to go for the chameleon. If you're experienced, you can go for one of the harder ones. If you want to take it easier, you can go for one of the shorter ones. So the chameleon is 11 kilometer walk and 1538 meters up. Exhausting to do, but well worth those views at the top. Uh, but yeah, we're now back at the camp. We're just resting for the rest of the evening, if I'm honest. We have dinner, get an early-ish night, and then move on to the next reserve tomorrow. I'll see you at Bye guys! There are frogs in the pool where we're staying.